In this video, I'll be going over subtracting fraction word problems. Here are two word problems with scenarios where we need to subtract fractions. The tip for this lesson is when taking something away or finding the difference, we subtract. So let's take a look at the first example. John had three fourths of his allowance with him. He spent one sixth of his allowance on candies. How much of his allowance does he have left? So in this scenario, we are starting with three fourths of his allowance and taking away one sixth of his allowance. When we are taking away something, we use subtraction. So we're going to take three fourths minus one sixth. So we have a situation with subtraction of fraction with unlike denominator. We have 4 and 6 and we need them to have a common denominator. So we will multiply by each other in the denominator. 4 will multiply by 6 and numerator also by 6. When you multiply denominator by a certain number, you need to multiply the numerator also by the same number. And for the 6, we're going to multiply by 4 and also the same for the numerator. And now we rewrite them. 6 times 3 is 18. 6 times 4, 24. Then we minus 1 times 4 is 4. 6 times 4 is 24. Now we have a common denominator. So we just need to subtract the numerator of 18 minus 4. So 18 minus 4 is 14 over 24. And we can see both numerator and denominator can divide by 2. So this will become 7 over 12 after we simplify. So 7 over 12 is how much of its allowance is still left. Now for the second example, Michelle ate 3 fourths of an apple pie and Louis ate 3 fifths of an apple pie. How much more did Michelle eat more than Lewis? So in this scenario, it's a difference problem. As we need to find the difference between 3 fourths and 3 fifths. And when we are finding the difference of fractions, we are subtracting. So we'll take 3 fourths minus 3 fifths. Here we also have a situation with unlike denominator. So we'll do the same. The 4 will multiply by 5 and the 5 will multiply by 4. And do the same in the numerator as you did in the denominator. Now we rewrite 5 times 3 is 15. 5 times 4 is 20 minus 3 times 4 is 12. 5 times 4 is 20. Now 15 minus 12, we have 3. And the common denominator is 20. So the answer is 3 20th more than Lewis. So these two are examples of how you would subtract fraction word problems. The main point is when you are taking something away or finding the difference of fractions, we use subtraction. So the first example was taking something away where John had three fourths of his allowance and he spent one sixth of his allowance. So he used one sixth of his allowance from the three fourths that he had originally. And the second example was a difference problem comparing how much Michelle ate and how much Lewis ate and finding the difference. We also have videos on how to subtract fractions with unlike denominators if you need further assistance on how to do that. I would recommend going over this video if you are still confused about how to subtract unlike denominators. Hopefully this video is helpful to you and thank you for watching.